that's obvious, but you just can't miss Cruz when he's on the field. I've never seen a player like him. I mean, he's six foot seven, weighs 220 pounds, and is the tallest shortstop in the history of Major League Baseball. Sliced hard, but foul. And that bunt goes foul. It's a strikeout. Here's Byron Buxton. And first offering is fouled off. One out, base is empty. And a big swing and a miss. Boom, that's Cheddar, baby. Good eye in that spot. It's a good take. One ball, two strikes, the count. The pitch. Swings and misses, struck him out. Two outs, base is empty. Nick Martini getting ready to hit. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Martini hitting third in the lineup. He joined the team as a free agent. What a stop. Over to first. Three up, three down, inning over. New inning getting started, and now the center fielder, Mickey Mantle. And a pitch. Bunted back towards the mound. Throw pulls him off the bag, and he's safe. Byron Buxton will hit next. Chris, he leads the way with the best batting average on the team. Here comes the pitch. There goes the runner from first. That's in for a strike. Got him. For the second. Ah! No score here in the second. Bunts it in the air. Torkelson brings it in and a couple of quick outs. Kyle Manzardo now at the plate. Drops a bunt down the first base side and they put the tag on him for the out. Back at Globe Life Field, ready to go for the last half of the inning. Here's Mookie Betts. Singy, you got to appreciate a guy who's this good to. Defensively. I mean, watching him track balls in the outfield, it is beautiful. And yeah, the right hander back to work. And yeah, there's one away. And Chris, beyond the fact that he's so incredible defensively, he also can swing the stick. Here's the third baseman, Gunnar Henderson. Just missed. Not giving him a pitch to hit there isn't a bad thing. He's dealing with a great first pitch hitter up there. And there's a strike. Good hitter at 98. Not close with that one. Ball two. Just missed. Righty delivers. Swing it a foul straight back. Here comes a pitch. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. Here's the second baseman, Zach Gellar. And he swings over the top there. On one. Two outs, base is empty. Now a screamer into the outfield. Mantle makes the grab, and that'll do it. Set for the start of the inning at the play. Hassan Kim. 
Roberts back to work. Bunts it straight back to the mound. Tosses to first. Leadoff man retired here in the third. And now Willie McCovey. Puts a bunt down. Gelloff. And he beats the throw. He's safe. Runner on at first with one. Gone. And now it's Julio Rodriguez. Here's the pitch. Runner on the go. Strike in there. Throw to second. Bunting for a hit. Scoops it up barehanded. Fires to first on the run. And he'll be safe at first. Trey Turner with a chance now. Grounded out his first time. And safe. It's a stolen base. And he pops up the bunt. And that is that. in Arlington as we go to the last of the third. Tommy Edmond at the plate and the pitch. On its way to the corner. Nobody can get there and it's a foul ball. Kicks and fires. Lays down a bunt to the right side. Ryan Jeffers at the plate. Fought off foul. And he deals. Run around the move. And that one finds its way through. And now runners at the corners. Nobody out. Oh, just a nice job coming through in a pretty high leverage spot right there. Just a simple ground ball the other way that had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Spencer Torkelson in the box now. Takes strike one. Runners at the corners. Nobody out. Here in the last half of the third. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Here's O'Neill Cruz. Have to say, he's one of the most impressive young players I've seen in recent years. Yeah, no question about it. His future is very Cal fly ball to right center. Racing into the alley. Can't get there. And they strike first as they take a 1-0 lead. Coming home. Here comes Edmund to score. Safe at the plate. It's a three run inside the park home run. Here's a big power threat. Byron Buxton. Late right on that fastball. And it's fouled away. Let's go, bro. Let's go, bro. Puts a bunt down. That takes care of Buxton. Two out, space is empty. Next is the designated hitter, Nick Martini. He's all for one. He swings and fouls one off. Well, he got challenged with a good fastball right there. Just couldn't catch up. Two outs. Back up the middle and a base hit.
Didn't try to do too much with it. Just a really controlled, simple swing. We don't see a whole lot of that these days with hitters trying to launch and hit home runs. But sometimes you got to shorten up just like that. Here's Mookie to hit. And no one can get there. Around third. He scores, and it's 4 nothing. Picks himself up an RBI. Challenged him with the fastball right in the heart of the zone, and he was clearly ready to jump all over it. Henderson in the box with two gone and takes a look at a called strike. Puts a bunt down. Boots it. And no shot to get him at first. There's two aboard. <laughs> now that second baseman. Now it's the second baseman, Zach Gillock. In there for strike one. Well, they've been able to score four runs off of him in this inning, and this is where you want to just max out, get as much as you can, give him one of those tough innings where it's going to be hard for him to recover in the next one. Puts a bunt down. Picks it up with a bare hand. He never gets off a throw. Everyone's safe, and a run comes in to score. Hello. Stepping in, Tommy Edmond. Buxton moves under it. And makes the play, and that's out number three. And welcome back to the ballpark. Now the number two hitter, Termar Johnson. The pitch. Gets the bunt down the right side, and he picks it up in foul territory. The 0-1. Bunting, and he pops it up. Tosses to first. That's the first out in the top of the fourth. And the batter down, Harry Ford. 0-1 for with a fly out to center. Bunts it in the air, and he grabs it in foul ground. One down, base is empty. Puts a bunt down. Oh, can't pick it up cleanly. Man at first with one gone. And now here is Mickey Mantle. Squares, pushes at it, misses it. It's a strike. It's 0-1. The pitch. And a sack bunt here. Gelong. And that's a bunt single. That was placed perfectly. Byron Buxton digs in now. Trying to move the runners over. Henderson goes to second safe there safe at first as they can't make the play bases loaded with one away Kyle Manzardo the next to hit swings through that one 0 and 1 here's an opportunity if you're going to get back in this game you have to take advantage of this situation this feels like their chance all loaded up. Dangerous hitter at the plate. Puts a bunt down. Gelaw. Fires over to first. Now two away as they get a run across. So up next, Ha Sung Kim. He's 0 for 1. Puts a bunt down. Over to first. That ends the inning. And they limit. And we're back. Bottom of the fourth, and here's the catcher, Brian Jeffers. The right-hander back to work. Mantle, long run on his horse. He's got it. One away. Almost a loud start to the inning on that first pitch. Man, he's going to want that one back, no doubt. So digging in, Spencer Torkelson. And first offering is fouled off. Kicks and deals. 
Buxton sprinting after it. Won't get to this one in the alley. They're still chasing it as he rounds second. Pulls into third safely with a triple. Put a pretty good jolt into that one. Great swing, nice balance and weight transfer. And he got it to drop in out there in the deep part of the field. Cruz into box again. Takes a strike. One away with a runner at third. We're here at the bottom of the fourth. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Here's the center fielder, Byron Buxton. Byron Buxton. Way back there. Gone. Is out of here. He made him pay for that one. It's seven one. So two away with nobody on. And next is the designated hitter, Nick oh. Martini. First pitch misses. Right through there for a strike. Goodness, I think he just took the best pitch he's going to see in this at bat. You don't get many like that in that location. I don't know if you take that pitch against any pitcher out there in the mound. Makes the grab and that'll end the inning. Globe Life Field, and now the DH, Willie McCovey, and the pitch. Lays down a bunt to the right That's side, and he picks it up, and he'll put it in his pocket. Clearly down in this ball game, and you can't look at the deficit and try to get it all back in one swing. It's got to come one at bat at a time, and even shrink it down smaller, pitch to pitch. Make that guy on the mound work to get you out. Julio Rodriguez will hit next. Bunts it towards the mound. On to Got first. It. Rodriguez out of the play. Here's Turner. Out of the play. Here's Unlockables. Oh, jerseys.
from the home of the Tigers since 2000. Comerica Park here in the Motor City Diamond Dynasty Baseball coming your way on the show. It's South Dakota going up against Los Angeles. All right, ready to go. Oh, here. Now, here is... O'Neill Cruz. The pitch. And a foul ball. The 0 1. Line drive. Calls it in, and there's one away. It's never fun going back to the dugout after hitting a line drive that finds a glove, but you will get some high fives. You know, when you make great contact, you feel like you've done everything right. But in this game of baseball, not everything is in your control. 0 oh, 1. Now 1 and 1. One out, base is empty. Squares, pushes at it, misses it. It's a strike. 1 and 2. Right-hander kicks, deals. Tapia sprinting after this one. Makes the catch for the second out. Now it's the DH, Nick Martini. That one's in there, 0-1. Out there on the mound, he's setting the tone early with the fastball, 98 miles per hour up on the scoreboard. Next nope. offering misses. One ball, one strike. Right into the plate. That one ripped. And that ball is gone. Yeah, baby. That one fell yeah, baby. It's one nothing. Here's Mookie now. Mookie bets. And first offering is fouled off. The pitch. Wouldn't chase that time. Hit weakly on the ground. So he's on at first here. And Single. We'll see how they score that one. No, oh, he didn't get much of that one, but it's going to look like a line drive in the box score tomorrow. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Now he breaks his bat. Makes the catch, inning over. Bottom of the first. Rymel Tapia up to hit. The wind and the pitch. And a swing and a miss there. 0-1. And that's outside. And the count is 1-1. One one. Another 2-2 upcoming. Pretty good pitch there to take a rip at. He wants to get his arms extended. He likes the ball away from him a little bit. Just not able to square it up. And Pablo Lopez will deliver. He goes down looking. Now, Brenton Doyle. That misses the zone. Ball one. There's a strike. 95 of that one. The 1-1. 
That one hit to right. Hauls it in to away. Josh Gibson stepping in now. His home run numbers stand out, Chris. Nobody has hit more in his team. And a foul ball. And yeah, that's too high. Two outs, bases empty. He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Buxton moves under it. Makes the catch. And that's the inning. Top of the second. Here's the second baseman. Ha Sung Kim. The second baseman. And that's Count ball one. Up. Kim batting sixth in today's lineup. And he's a native of Columbia. Hey. Swing and a miss. Strike one. I got a ball one strike. out to right Clemente in position hauls it in for the out and now the right fielder Roberto Clemente thanks a 6-1 lefty he features a four seam fastball a slider a changeup a slurb and he works in a sinker Lifted in the air down the left side. Tapia makes the grab. Two down. Brian Jeffers at the plate. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. That gets down for a hit. So a two out knock keeps the inning alive. Let's go. Waste no time there. Looped that one in there for the knock. Definitely got that pitch on the outside of the cap a little bit, but he made it work for him. Here's a high chopper. To second for Yao. And that will end the inning. Back here in Detroit. Bottom of the second. Leading off, Josh Naylor. Naylor goes 5 feet 11 inches, 26 years old. A former first-round pick back in 2015. Right back to him on the mound. Gets it to first. One up, one, one down. down. One up, one down. One up, one down. Now it's the second baseman, Michael Massey. Michael Massey. Out to short. Cruz on to first. Two down. Already two out here in the home half of inning number two. Isaiah Kiner Falefa up to the plate. Kiner Falefa. This lineup's going to have to find a way to make him work a little harder out there on the mound. I mean, he is just mowing him down. He's settling in. You've got to make him uncomfortable. Maybe step out of the box, call timeout, do whatever it takes. And look yeah, out as that one ran in and got him. He had two strikes on him, and he hit him. So a man aboard, and here is Roberto Clemente. Oh, he jumped the gun for second. To yeah. second, and he's out. And that's the third out. This dude's going to quit. Back at Comerica Park, top half of the third inning. Stepping in, the slugging shortstop, O'Neill Cruz. 
Gone. O'Neal. Cool. <laughs> A gigantic blast. It's 2 nothing. Here's Byron Buxton. He's 0 for 1. Always exciting to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up and you start to expect a big inning. Hey. That one's in there. 4-1. One, one. Way one high. Right. The real threats are coming up. Already given up a home run in this inning. It's going to really have to bear down. One run across in the frame so far. We're here in the top half of inning number three. Out of line, out towards center. That's a base hit. He was all over that one. Other than ripping one into the gap or blasting one over the wall, there aren't a whole lot of hits that are more satisfying than a nice line drive in the center field. Well, so that definitely felt good. Martini in now. Takes ball one off the plate. Ball Next two. offering upstairs. When the skipper calls down to the bullpen, he's expecting the guy to come ball in right and get outs. So far, not getting what he was hoping for. Buxton on the run. Pitch in for a strike. Safe at second, and that was not close. Man, is he fast. That is so fun to he's watch. Going, he's going, he's Runner going. on the go again. There's the ball. Pretty easy walk right there. Last pitch wasn't even much to think about. Here's Mookie now. Reached on an infield single his first time. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. That one's in there, and that is strike one. Boog, this guy's definitely a plus runner, but what I love about him is that he goes all out every single time, never takes a break. It's guys like that, even though they don't have the elite speed, the fact that they're consistent with it, they make moves on the base paths. Lefty out of the stretch, runners at first and third. Two balls, two strikes. The pitch. Spoils that one, and it remains two and two. And here it comes. Still two and two after the foul ball. Buxton at third. Martini out at first with nobody out. Flying drive, and that's base hit out of the center field. In comes the run from third to add on. And they're up by three. To third, tag, got it. Next to hit, Gunnar Henderson. 0 for 1 so far. In for a strike. Going 1. 1 out and a runner at second. Swing and a miss. And he got him to chase. But this started in and ended up on the outs. Runner takes off. Swing and a miss. Throw save. Gibson too late for the throw. Well, he made it look easy, but I can tell you that was not a favorable matchup. Here's the second baseman, Ha Sung Kim. Now there's a certain point where you have to commit to what you think you see, and he guessed wrong right there. Nasty slider with just terrific bite at the end. Two outs. Swing and a miss. Now one and two. Clearly was sitting on a fastball right there and just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. Goes down looking. Set for the bottom of the third. Now it's the right fielder, Roberto Clemente. The line of the pitch. The other way. Gets down base hit. 
Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Tyler Gentry, the batter now, as he swings and misses for strike one. In the air, right side. Clemente in position. Squeezes it. Then there's one down. Now it's the shortstop, Robin Yell. The shortstop. Foul ball. And base hit. The throw in. Safe at second. So the lineup flips over. And now Rymel Tapia. Hit on the ground. Might be two. To first. Hey. And he beats it. Everyone's safe. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Brenton Doyle. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. First pitch swinging. Well, a come and get me fastball right there. He didn't look ready for the velocity. I think it'd be a mistake to throw him anything off speed right here. Righty delivers. That ball is foul, and the pressure is building. Bases loaded, one away here in the last half of the third. Ground ball right side. Over to Cruz. There's one. Double play. What a twin killing. To nice Indiana. job. And welcome back to the ballpark. And now the right fielder, Roberto Clemente. Roberto Clemente. And a pitch. There's so much Clemente can do with the plate and in the field. The wind of the pitch. Pop foul out of play off to the right. About the only thing Clemente didn't have was elite speed. But the other four tools were as strong as anyone's in the game. And now the lefty got him swinging. Here's the catcher to hit, Brian Jeffers. One for one with a single so far. That one's in there. That's strike one. Line drive, base hit. So a man aboard now with one away. That's back-to-back -back singles for him. Just a solid swing right there. Caught it out front and ripped it into the outfield for the base hit. Those always feel great. Now at the plate, Rafael Palmero. And that's downstairs and outside. Jeffers, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. Swing and a miss, and that one missed one by ball. a ton. Two strike. Two, two, down. The two two. Palmero checks his swing, appeal to third, and no swing, says Joe McDonald. 3-2 now. Swings and lines one towards the gap. And base hit. A base hit. They get it in quickly. So first and second now, one out. Back-to-back -back singles. Hooked around that pitch on the outside, but he was still able to square it up pretty nicely. And that takes quick, strong wrist to pull that off. Cruz, the next to hit, takes out. 
guy's gonna quit. Side. Your attention, please. Now, Harlan. Garcia. And a sack bun here. Connor Falefa to first, and he beats it. Everyone's safe. No problem beating out the infield hit right there. Good hustle getting down the line. Now the base is loaded. Big opportunity for them to break this game open. Buxton stands in now, looks at that one inside. And another ball. Pressure's on right here. 2 0 count, base is loaded. You don't want to fall to a three ball count and then walk in a run. He's got to challenge the hitter right here. All loaded up. Dangerous hitter at the plate. Breaking ball inside. And that's ball three. Battling here as he fouls it away. Grand slam, Bucky. Come on, Bucky. Payoff pitch. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Got him looking. He didn't make it easy for him on the mound, but they still get the strikeout. Nick Martini getting ready to hit. He's already homered here in this one. Fly ball down the line. On the move towards the line. Won't get to this one. It drops foul. Two outs. One and one. To the play, and he's out. Out to escape oh, the bases loaded jam unscathed. And we're back, and here is Josh Gibson. Lopez back to work. That one finds the zone, and that's strike one. Oh, he's looking great so far. It helps when over 80% of your first pitches are strikes. He might be able to go the distance if he keeps this up. And he hits a ground ball right side. Gibson retired at first. One down. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. On the ground, out to short. To first, two up, two, two down. down. Now here is Michael Massey. Grounded out his first time up. That one pushed foul. Two down, nobody on. We're here in the bottom of the fourth. That one the other way. Hauls it in to end the inning. Back here in Detroit. We go to the top of the fifth. Here's a big power threat. Nick Martini. As the lefty gets to work. That one nope. missed. Garcia, in his seventh season, he features a four-seam fastball, a slider, and he works in a changeup. Sizes this one up. Puts it away for the out. One up, one down. Now it's I'm going to be playing all night. So if you're with me, stay with me. You know, Berg, Mookie Betts may have not been named MVP in 2023, but... 
That doesn't take away from his impressive season. The Dodgers star hit nearly 40 home runs and drove in more than 100. Ronald Acuna Jr. deserved to win, but it was another phenomenal season in Mookie's career. Now the third baseman, Gunnar Henderson. And he swings and misses at the initial offer. Henderson goes six feet, three inches, 22 years old. Usually a short stop, but today starts at third. Yelp running hard to get it. And puts Damn. the squeeze on that one. And that is that. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's the third baseman, Isaiah Kiner Falefa. Isaiah Kiner Falefa. As he turns on the rubber, and with that good live arm delivers. Foul ball there. Well, these players, as you probably noticed, haven't been shy at the plate at all. In fact, they've probably been too aggressive at times. They're swinging at more than 70% of the first pitches they've seen today, and it's just not working out for them. The 0-2. And right back to the mound. Slings the oh. first. And that's the first out in the bottom of the fifth. The right now it's the right fielder, Roberto Clemente. And he's already singled in this game. And he grounds one to the right side. Kim with the throw to first. And a couple of quick outs. Two outs, base is empty. Tyler Gentry digs in now. Hard hit, right side. Palmero takes it to the bag, and it's a 1-2-3 inning. All right, we go to the top half. of inning number six and now ha sung kim now here comes a pitch that's in for a strike well kim is one of those players that it's just hard to take your eyes off of him and not many players in the 2023 world baseball classic had more fun than he did he hit a grand slam and a win against china and earlier in the tournament had a two homer game delivered some special moments for Korea and a pitch slice down the right side and another ball in the air to left down the line Tapia makes the play and there's one down Roberto Clemente now at the plate. Roberto Clemente. Line drive, base hit. Just kind of sliced that one into center. Now no waiting around right there. He was ready to swing it on the first pitch. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. Digging in, Ryan Jeffers. At the belt and fires. That one well upstairs. And that is ball one. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. Clemente on the goal. And that bank goes foul. It's a strikeout. And he makes the catch. To the bag himself. It's a double play, and that'll end the inning. Six, and the batter will be the shortstop, Robin Yen. Lopez back to work. And that one in the air center field. Buxton moves under it. And there's one away. So up next, Rymel Tapia. Line 
high drive. Makes the grab, and there's two out. That swing right there tells me he's seeing the ball pretty well. I know it didn't produce a hit, but he made solid contact, and that's all you're looking to do anytime you're at the plate. And a foul ball. On the ground. And that one finds its way through. And with the inning still alive, here comes the heart of the order. And now the catcher comes up to him, Josh Gibson. Fought off foul. Two outs. Headed towards the corner. Hops over the wall, and that's an automatic double. And now it's Josh Naylor. Well, I guarantee you, after that last visit from the pitching, bit of strategy here. They issue the intentional walk, and that'll set up a force play at any base. Two outs, bases full. Michael Massey, the next to hit. Swing and a tapper that rolls foul. Pretty frugal guy. He is very efficient with the pitch count in this one. Down the line. Betts is on the move. Couldn't get to it before it dropped foul. With the go-ahead run at the plate here in the bottom of the sixth. Man, that got him square in the mask. That one down the line. And foul ball. Left-hand hitter waits. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Five foul balls in a row. I have no idea what that feels like. But you got to love this battle. Just wondering who's going to blink first. Here's the 0-2. Got him! Third out, and that ends the frame. We go to the top of the seventh, and now Rafael Palmero. Rafael Palmero. And the pitch. Fastball for a strike, and it's 0 and 1. And ball one. And he deals. Swing, and a ball popped up. Yao drifts towards it. One down. Here's O'Neill Cruz. He's already homered in this game. The shortstop, O'Neill Cruz. That one fouled off. Well, he got challenged with a good fastball right there. Just couldn't catch up. One down, base is empty. One and ball. that one upstairs. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. And now it's going to be Byron Buxton. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Down the middle for a strike. 0-1-1. Well, he had a pretty good look at that pitch and not sure exactly what tied him up there. Couldn't pull the trigger. And perhaps the best pitch we'll see in this at bat to hit. That's hard hit on the line. Drops for a hit. He couldn't run it down. Round second, digging for third. No. All over that one right there. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. Two outs. Doyle sizing this one up. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. Bottom of the seven, stepping in, Isaiah Kiner Falefa. Third baseman, Isaiah 
And the right hander back to work. And there's a foul ball. On a line, base hit. Makes the turn and heads for second. And he's into second with nobody out. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch he could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. And now the right fielder, Roberto Clemente. Ball and the first pitch back. misses for ball one. If you're going to get something going, this is the time to do it. You get the leadoff man on. Everybody's got to look over the shoulder and say, I'm just going to keep the line moving. Don't try to do too much. Good hitters count the 2-0. Lifted in the air right center field. Clemente in pursuit makes the catch and there's one gone next to hit Tyler Gentry Late with the swing there. Pretty amazing, oh his first pitch strike percentage, over 90%. You know you're getting something in the zone first pitch. So if you're a hitter, you got to be ready to let it fly, hey. even though he's had a lot of success on that first pitch of the at-bat. And it's second. Swings and sends a rocket to right. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. Two down. Robin Young will hit next. One for two. These fans, they are ready to cheer about something. And that one fouled off. Foul off down the right side. In the air to left center. And that'll fall for a base hit. The throw in. Not in time. BC. A run scores. It's a two-run game. So digging in, Rymel Tapia. And a foul ball. The tying run at the plate. This one chopped in the ground, but foul. That one back up the middle, and it gets through. Throw in holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. First and second, two down. And now the center fielder, Brenton. So out of the pen comes the right-hander, Alexis Diaz. These are the spots relievers really make a name for themselves, late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put. Well, he's under it to make the catch in center, and we'll take a break. And now it's Mookie Betts. The pitch. Swang and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. And the leadoff man aboard. Clearly seeing the ball very well in this one. I could watch base hits like that one all day long. And so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive in the center field. Trying to move him over here. Spire makes the catch for the out. And there's one away. Now it's the second the baseman, ha Sung Kim. Baseman. Kim. Check swing, and he held up. In the center. Doyle right there to make the grab. Runner tagging for third. He is hey. safe. Now it's the right fielder. Clemente 
one for three. The other way. He's got it. And that is out number three. Back at Comerica Park at the play. Josh Gibson. The pitch. Fought off foul. Diaz. In his third season, he features a slider, a four-seamer, and he works in a two-seamer. Started after the 0-1 pitch, and now a check down to first. Did not go. That's to third. Henderson. The tag, and he's out. Here's Josh Naylor. Up the middle, Cruz. The throw to first, and a couple of quick outs. So two down now, and here is Michael Massey. Bounced up the middle. Oh, a great grab on the dive. But there's no play for him, and that's going to extend the inning. And now here is Isaiah Kiner Falefa. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. Runner on the go. Pitch in for a strike. Throw to second. Out at second. That ends the inning. Welcome back to the ballpark. We go to the ninth. Now it's going to be Ryan Jeffers. Spire back to work. Swing and a miss. Chased it out of the zone. And it's even up. Now before the 1-1, time is called. And a pitch. That's in for a strike at 95. And the count is one and two. Gets to it on to first. Got him. One away on the strikeout. And yeah, the batter now, Rafael Palmero. Shoots a line drive single into right center. Didn't take long to get a result for that at bat. Good job getting the foot down so he could catch it. Out front and pull it. Turned on it nicely for the knock. O'Neill Cruz digs in now. And first offering is fouled off. Palmero over at first with one away. Got him. Two away. And at first, Byron Buxton now at the plate. That one is absolutely belted. And out of here. That'll fire up the dugout. And they tack on to their lead. It's 5-1. Martini in the box here. Let's that one go for a ball. And there's the strike. Let's see if he's willing to use the whole field right here. Definitely pounding him away. Here's a 1-1. Hit on the ground to the right side. And that's just foul. Line to right, and that'll be a base hit. Here's Mookie Betts. That one finds the zone. That's strike one. 
Fastball almost got him there. Straighten him up a little bit. Two outs. Swing and a miss. As he was out front that time. Here's the pitch. Runner goes. Pitch misses. And that's a stolen base. Not even close. Runner at second. Two down. Drilled out towards left center field. That's well struck. Doyle makes the play. And it's out number three. We're back, and on the mound is the closer, Brock Stewart. And he's got a nice lead to work with, so he should come in throwing strikes, attacking these hitters. Connor Falefa now at the plate as he swings through strike one. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. Bounce to the left side. A sliding stop at short, and that's a great play for the out. He's two outs away. Roberto Clemente getting ready to hit. And that one fouled off. Right-handed reliever. Line to left. Betts snags it for the second out. So it's their last chance in this one. And now Tyler Gentry. Yeah, he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. I think he was sitting off speed there. Base knock right field. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball. He let it get deep, took the barrel right to it, and then extended through the swing for the line drive base hit. And here is Robin Yell headed down the line. And no one could get to it. It's a foul ball. Fastball right back to the mound. And that'll do it. Sometimes it takes just getting away from home. Players can sort of come together, connect a little bit more than they do when they're at home with their families. And that can breed to success on the field, as we saw in this game today. Excellent win by this team. 5-1 is how it ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chambi saying so long. And our final line score, first for the victorious visiting team, five runs, 15 hits, two errors, they left 10 runners on base. For the home team, one run on nine hits, one error, they left 10 runners on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 52 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon, and we remind you to please right home safely.
Yes.
welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. We've got Diamond Dynasty Baseball tonight. It's the Mud Hens and the Astronauts. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Here's O'Neill Cruz. The pitch. And a foul ball. Left hand batter waits. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. The pitch. Got him looking for the strikeout. Clipped the bottom of the zone with a curve for strike three. Here's Byron Buxton. And first offering is fouled off. And the right hander deals. Bunted back towards the mound. Throws to first. That takes care of Buxton. Nick Martini, the next to hit. Nick Martini. Swing and a miss. It's 0 1. That's a slider for a strike. Well, he had a pretty good look at that pitch and not sure exactly what tied him up there. Couldn't pull the trigger. And perhaps the best pitch he'll see in this at bat to hit. Up with it. Fires to first. Oh. In time, the 2 3 strikeout ends the inning. Now a chance for Ryan Howard. Nobody on his team is a better batting average than he does, Siggy. Strike one. This is a hitter who takes his game to another level playing at night. And strike two. That misses the zone. And the count one and two. Hit hard, base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. 